Dear friends, we are starting with the problems. First, we are considering the problem of gears. First problem, the data is given like this. A reduction gear supported on bearings on either side transmits 90 kilowatt of power. The pinion has a pitch circle diameter of 180 millimeter and rotates at 600 rpm. Determine the maximum force applied due to power transmitted if the pressure angle of the involute teeth is 20 degree. Dear friends, let us first of all note down the given data. Here the power transmitted by reduction gear is given P is equal to 90 kilowatt and the pitch circle diameter of the pinion is given that T is equal to 180 millimeter that is equal to 0 0.180 meter which rotates at 600 rpm so N is equal to 600 rpm we have to find out the maximum force applied because of power transmission. Let us say F max is to be find out during power transmitted when the pressure angle of involute teeth is given that is phi is equal to 20 degree. So here let us uh, understand the given data with the help of diagram. These are the matting gears, these are their centers of rotation and this is a common tangent along which because of rotation of this the force acts. Let us say the rotation direction is this, so the force will act radially perpendicular in this direction to say F and the maximum force will act along the line of action that is oriented at 20 degree as the pressure angle given is 20 degree. So this is the line of action that is we can also say the pressure line and the angle is given 20 degree. So here the force going to act is equal to F max. So we have to find out this F max. So from the given data, we know the relation between power and torque that P is equal to 2 pi and T divided by 60 where capital T stands for torque. So we can calculate torque acting T is equal to P into 60 divided by 2 pi n. So substituting the values here power is given in kilowatt so we are writing in terms of watt. So, torque is equal to 90 into 1000 multiplied by 60 divided by 2 into pi into n that is equal to 600 rpm. On calculation, we found that torque acting T is equal to 1432.5 newton into meter now we know that this torque is given by t is equal to force into radial distance in diagram that is this distance 
ah we can say it is a pitch radius so torque is equal to we can write f into d by 2 and hence the force acting f is equal to t into 2 divided by d substituting the values we found that equal to 1432.39 into 2 divided by diameter is equal to 0.180 on calculation we found that the force is equal to 15915.49 newton now this is the force acting radially uh, tangentially perpendicular to radius in direction of norm, uh, common tangent but the maximum force is acting in this direction that is at angle of 20 degree so from the diagram we can write the relation between f max that is acting along the pressure line and the force along the common tangent that is f max is equal to f upon cos phi substituting the values that is equal to 15915.49 divided by cos of 20 degree it gives the value is equal to 16 936 kilo newton sorry newton so writing in terms of kilo newton that is f max will be equal to 16.936 kilo newton this is the maximum force acts <coughs> during the transmission of power thank you